Hey, Crypto Growth Fam, how's it going? This is your host, Shazib, signing in. We're back with another video, guys, and this is a follow-up to my previous Cult DAO video. And in this video, I'm going to be discussing reasons as to why Cult DAO is or can be much more than a meme coin guys so it's going to be an interesting video do watch till the end and folks for those of you who are new to the channel we primarily discuss utility coins you guys can see which ones we usually discuss we discuss these as well as other potential gems as well so if you're interested then do hit the notification bell and subscribe for regular videos guys since the last time we discussed about and i talked about cult dao Look what it has done, guys. Check this out. This uh, uh, chart has been on fire. I'm going to be telling you the catalyst of this move as well and why uh, this move is merely uh, the beginning of what the cult DAO can do in the future, its potential, if they succeed in what they aim to do, basically, guys. So check this out. We started even I think uh, I talked about cult uh, in at these levels, guys. <laughs> it was the price was around here at these at uh, at these points at this point range, guys. Let me show you the all time chart. Yeah, it was here around here. I think uh, no, yeah, two 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 three. I think this was the area we talked about about cult, guys. If you took profits in it and if you've invested in it and you've made a you've made a few gains i'm really happy about uh, about that if you watch the video and have made some gains these are short-term games the gains whenever i explore a project i look at the long-term potential obviously crypto is volatile it can uh, go north or it can go south but uh, obviously i try to take calculated risks and speculations but anything can happen so do your own due diligence your own research guys and uh, only invest what you can afford to lose by the way the market cap is dollar 14.83 at the moment guys let me show you guys it was only nine or yeah around nine around seven around eight or nine uh, million dollars when we last discussed it in our last video or the video before that so kudos to those who have made the gains but guys let me tell you something in all honesty this move was a catalyst that was uh, due to the meme coin explosion the meme coins were performing well so cult dao performed well so does that technically make uh, cult dao a meme coin uh, that certainly, I think, is not the case because what uh, Cult DAO aims to do, guys, it can prove to be revolutionary. It can prove to be something that we're going to be talking about for years to come if they achieve what they aim to achieve. And uh, uh, obviously, the idea is uh, achieved. I think this this has the potential to do uh, really well in the long run, guys. The to tokenomics are great. I'm going to be discussing them and the use case. Check this out. The uh, uh, being a token that has only 14 million uh, dollar market cap, guys. Check out the locked liquidity. I think uh, for fourteen million dollar coin, it has five to se I think seven million dollars liquidity locked, or five million if I'm not wrong. Uh, that and uh, the code is locked for the liquidity is locked for two sixty four years, guys, and the code is immutable. Nobody can change it. I mean, this is the code is extremely great. I'm going to be showing you that as well. Check out how many exchanges it is it is listed in, and uh, this Q coin Gate.io Maxi. Uh, Uniswap V2. Check out the volume, guys. Volume has increased tremendously. Dollar 3.81 mil million dollar volume at the moment. Uh, check this out. It even went as far as dollar 5.10 million. But obviously, let me tell you, this was due to the meme coin boost. But uh, uh, Kalzao is uh, more than a meme coin, or it can prove to be more than a meme coin, obviously, due to its fundamentals. First and most foremost, guys, it is building its own uh, ZK EVM powered, uh, powered blockchain, guys. Z uh, ZK is zero knowledge, Ethereum virtual machine compatible uh, blockchain, and it is the first that is powered by a decentralized autonomous organization, a DAO, 
powered by Kaldao. It modulus, it is called modulus. Modulus is in testnet. The testnet is live, guys. There are projects that are being built on top of it. I'm going to be showing you showing you. This is the modulus I. And this is a hyper deflationary coin, guys. Uh, the transactions that are going to be happening in uh, the projects and in the modulus ecosystem, it's going to be burning the circulating supply of Kaldao. It was the max supply was 6.67 trillion when it started. And now the circulating supply uh, after its launch, when did it launch? Let me show you guys. Uh, yeah, Mar March 2022. So it was launched in a bear market, guys, and it has uh, already burned so much. Check this out, 4.32 trillion. Besides that, a lot of coin are staked. And uh, aside from stake, guys, uh, a lot of uh, these uh, the, the tokenomics is going to be the investment-based tokenomics that are that I'm going to be discussing in a moment are going to be coming back to burn cult further, guys. So it is a hyper deflationary coin. It is uh, the aim of, of uh, basically all of this ecosystem is to burn cult and give it utility. Check this out. This is what I'm, uh, this is the modulus is what I'm uh, happy about that this is something that uh, differentiates uh, cult from a meme coin. You're just a random meme coin, guys. Scalability, introducing faster transactions, community owned, the tight knit of com community of cult welcomes new builders to build on modulus, privacy first. Future development for modulus includes the unique ability to opt in or out of private transactions. Check this out, powered by Kaldao. These are the projects being built on modulus, guys. Check this out. Extremely cool uh, concepts. Uh, Ape Calypse. Okay, so this project established a bridge between the real world and Web3. Bank of Nowhere. Welcome, Bank of Nowhere, friends. DeFi banking with sweet crypto goodness. Cultpad is the launchpad from raising funds to finding the next unicorn in Modulus ZK. Cultpunks is the NFT collection for Modulus. Giuco, this is an interesting project. I'm going to be showing you guys Land of Cult. This is a MMORPG, guys. So a game built on top of Modulus. Modulus domain service made in Italy, DAO, send it. Soupsy, Sleepy Swap. Uh, so yeah, the rug game, Toto, extremely uh, interesting projects over here, guys. An ecosystem being built, prote protect crypto assets and self custody wallets. Let me show you something. This is Stone Swap, guys. This is the decentralized exchange of uh, cult, and it has made a name for itself. Six uh, uh, six thousand two hundred forty-two followers, providing the first dex for Modulus zk. Yeah, it's an honor for Stone to be the first Dex for Modulus ZK. We never forget our motive. Always striving to provide a wonderful adventure. This is a Dex. Check out the tokenomics. Dex distribution, 5% to burn Stone, 5% to buy and, buy and burn Cult. So the ecosystem burns Cult. There is another coin, Revolt, as well as, as, well as the Rug game. All of these, the ecosystem uh, merges. The amalgamation takes place to burn Cult, guys. I was talking about another project. This is Land of Cult. Welcome to Land of Cult's official Twitter, where darkness meets destiny. Check out our socials. Although it has only 182 followers at the moment, but it has it has joined in October 2023, so this is recent. Uh, breaking news: Land of Cult has officially landed a spot on the prestigious Modulus website. More teasers are around the corner. Stay tuned. So yeah, something calling up in the Land of Cult. Check this out, guys. They're basic. This is basically a MMORPG being built, guys. Uh, yeah, seems cool. Yeah. So, in my opinion, uh, what Cult aims to do or is doing, I think it uh, differentiates it from a lot of projects, guys. It is not your random uh, meme coin, and it is. It has even been uh, categorized in. Let me show you guys in uh, the zero knowledge category zero knowledge proofs yeah i think it has been listed over here as well uh, let me show you guys yeah yeah where is it where is it yeah here is it called uh, so the move that took place guys was based on the meme coin hype but it certainly is more than a meme coin or can be more than a meme coin for sure let me show you the tokenomics i've shared this uh, before as well Basically, the whenever the buying and selling happens, 0.4% tax is collected on every TX. Basically, this goes into the treasury, which collects the fees. Uh, 
there are uh, a lot of stakers in the in the cult ecosystem no, uh, and when the when a wallet stakes uh, his or her cult it basically basically becomes decult so basically uh, the first 50 uh, decult owners are known as the guardians and the rest are known as many so the guardians uh, are the ones that give proposals with the recommendations of the many and these proposals are then vote, vote up, voted upon to uh, approve or disapprove and then the uh, this can be of various sorts basically it can be de de depend it de can be uh, regarding an investment and uh, anything like a noble cause or uh, furthering decentralization this is their agenda and uh, one more thing guys whenever uh, these investments are made when the treasury goes up to 15.5 ethereum if when it is raised to 15.5 ethereum if a proposal is or once it has been approved treasury will auto send 13 ethereum to the investi wallet and send 2.5 ethereum of cult to a burn wallet so another burn mechanism proposals can be put forward and approved without limit they just will not be paid until the treasury has been replenished to 15.5 ethereum of cult so basically what happens is uh, when whenever these investments are then then uh, put forward when the investments come back guys when nbs investi company sells their token for curls at a bur at burn and distribution rate agreed 50% is sent to burn wallet and 50% gifted back to decult owners. So the stakers are rewarded yet again. Users can stake cult into decult. The stakers are rewarded. 50% goes to stakers and the 50% goes to the dead wallet, the burn wallet, guys. So this is the mechanism. And you know that in a bear market, they've, I think, uh, invested in more than 100 projects, I believe. And their treasury is going. I'm, uh, let me show you the uh, cult dune as well where everything is transparent open sourced everyone can see it they've invested in uh, great projects like uh, vra veracity as well as uh, let me show you guys chain link guys the projects we discussed time and again this is their uh, this is called dune.com cult what is called DAO, the holders treasury 3,914 cult, decult holders, 19,157 cult holders. Check this out. USD value holdings, the investments that they've made and everything. I mean, everything you guys can see in real time. I think, yeah, it is constantly updated if I'm not wrong. These are the proposals that have taken place. Veracity. Yeah. Most of the projects they aim or uh, they invest in are decentralized yeah where is it chain link yeah chain link we've discussed it it has the it has the potential to become huge polygon matic mesha mena protocol as well guys so yeah guys mena protocol chain link near protocol sandbox polka dot matic you you guys get the idea right woof work this has given a good this has given good gains shibirium bone so yeah uh, the uh, this is the entire concept and and uh, it, uh, i made this video as a follow up to our, my last video to show what cult has been up to but uh, this move was based on the meme hype but uh, uh, i think that uh, cult is or is or can be much more than meme coin when modulus goes live and these projects are well established so I, in my opinion it has good potential do your own due diligence your own research and re read what cult is all about so guys this was it for the video and yeah let me show you one more thing guys when i made the last video a community member made this photo for me guys check this out he sent me this photo i was bamboozled i mean check this out guys i mean isn't it cool like the community is extremely passionate about cult how like i was astonished to see that i just made a video and it i think uh, uh, triggered a lot of passionate fans out there guys so uh, let check do check this out guys it is a bit uh, interesting do your own research do your own due diligence and say stay, stay safe only invest what you can afford to lose guys Anyways, this was it for the video. If you liked it, make sure to like, share, and subscribe, and comment. And if you're interested in any of these other coins as well and other potential gems that we usually discuss, 
do hit the notification bell and subscribe for regular videos. Like I always say at the end, until next time, stay blessed and stay tuned. Thank you very much, everyone.